Hello everybody and welcome back to the Sky PC LP of Mighty Bison and I am going to get back into the, uh, the last chapter where we were. Uh, in between last one and this one I have not really grinded per se. <laughs> okay, forgot about this. Um, when I say per se I just went to the uh, first level of Glare Forest and I uh, I did it again just to see if I could get any more. Kid, are you Krichevskoy's son? Who are you? Me? I am the overlord of an alternate netherworld. An alternate netherworld? That's right. I tried taking over this world before, but Krichevskoy got in the way. Now that he's dead, I'll claim it for my own. You are just one of the overlords that I will crush on my way to becoming the Supreme Overlord. Puny boy. What you see before you represents only a fraction of my power. Well, that's really hard to tell since I can only see part of you. Yep, you're just too big. Fine. If it's size you're concerned about, I can make adjustments. But even so, a horrible death still awaits you. Feel my wrath. Here I go. Determination. You like this stuff, don't you? Yes, I love this stuff. Now let's go, everybody. Okay. So uh, let's get into it. Yeah. Okay. So I remember when I played this game originally. Uh, like, unlike this guy at Five, where it's like, oh yeah, all these nether worlds and stuff. Uh, this game kind of presented it in a way in which made you think that there was only the uh, the one, and then there were alternate uh, timeline type things. Whereas you get a uh, whereas in this guy at Five, you get ones that are like, oh no, it's just it's just there are a bunch of worlds. So this is uh, this is a level where you're intended to lose, and I like I know you can win, uh, and I think it changes. I don't think it changes the ending per se, but it changes um, just some other stuff. Uh, so I'm gonna just try and win. But it won't work, but I figure I might as well try at least. Um, but I'm not gonna try too hard. <laughs> Bunching everyone up. Uh, just to make it easy uh, for them to try and kill me in one hit. Oops, turn there. Yeah. Because they're all level 75, so I'm not going to be doing enough damage. His love is to buy a ten ways, yeah, sure. That was a big help, you loony angel. I mean, honestly, <laughs> put all those 70, level 75s together and you'd have more than no chance. That's odd. Isn't the hero supposed to win? No, um, we're demons, not heroes. Well, ha ha ha, even if my powers divide an overlord is still an overlord, it wouldn't matter how many puny boys like you there were, I'd crush them all. I thought the sound of chess code would be a lot tougher, but I guess I was wrong. Damn it. Uh, die punk, say hello to Pardrex, go in hell. Wait just a minute. Oh my god. People that left. You guys. Who are you? We got loyal bastards of King Kitrex, go away. You dare say for the no world we will defeat the name of the Lady King. Hmm. 
this last hand on us. We'll move here in case our help is needed. Liars, your hand or the prince just like the others, isn't that right? <laughs> of course not. Oh, come now. Looks like you hit the nail on the head. <laughs> Plus, they don't have any luck with vassals. <laughs> uh, come now, they're here to help you anytime you need, right? Only because you're waiting to ambush me. Uh, hey, quit ignoring me. I sent you all the king over. Trying to transfer, like, prepare yourselves. Don't underestimate us with the feet. Now I think, uh, yeah. So now it's basically just, I have to have one person now. It's just, now it's just don't die. <laughs> but these guys are all very much strong enough to just demolish the enemies. And they can't even like hit them. So, the interesting thing about this is, it is one of the only instances in the entirety of Disgaea where I can think of um, a point where they give you um, a map where you are intended to lose. Like, that doesn't happen very often. Okay. Now... I'm gonna try and get like a kill. Uh, just because if I do, it will make future things a little bit easier. I don't quite uh, need to remember where this attack lands. Okay, so the place right around here is safe. That's good. sure what how this map works if you try and fight it again uh, but I'm pretty sure it doesn't uh, doesn't carry over everything like it would previously or it, it doesn't have like all these level 75s there to like just grind off of yeah. so I just got the free levels from that which was nice and I got a crap ton of hell because I killed two of them Check cast now, take care, Prince. They're actually pretty strong. The wise rock has his towns, that's saying it's pretty good. I wish they would stop hiding the towns when it comes to working for me. Okay. I'm actually kind of curious as to what the map looks like. Uh, without level 75s, but uh, I'm not going to bother looking it up or, or going to it. So, uh, I didn't bother looking at my equipment before going to the thing, so I won't buy anything. Okay, Night Dweller. So this is the only one with five so far, I think. Oh, We've uh, been waiting for you, demons! When the darkness of evil draws near, we appear out of nowhere! The three lights of justice save the world with courage and hope. Together, we are... The Prism Rangers! I love how <laughs> the yellow-orange one just has no enthusiasm. Please, someone normal come out! Cool! <laughs> hey, Ed 
Anna, how about we do our own poses? Oh, you serious? You better believe it! Um, but I have a question for you guys. A question? Go ahead, shoot! You call yourselves Prism Rangers, but you only have three colors. That's not even enough for a rainbow. Isn't it obvious? We don't have any friends. Being a hero is a lonely existence. You got it? Are you sure there's not another reason why you don't have any friends? You guys are heroes, aren't you? Why would you want to be overlords? We want friends, of course. If we become the overlords, then we'll have tons of friends. And the Prism Rangers will have all the colors of the rainbow. Here we go! Blue! Yellow! Transform! Bang! Blue! Yellow! This can't be happening. Blue and yellow have been shot! I, I can't transform on my own! Curse you! Shooting before we even have a chance to transform? How inconsiderate! Are you demons? Uh-huh. Oh my gosh! I completely forgot about that! Is your helmet on too tight? You should have transformed first, then come out! That's not how it's supposed to be! A true defender of justice transforms in front of the enemy! Swan, which side are you on? Then I'll just have to play my ace card! The demons I hired will help me! Is it okay for a hero to be using demons? Of course! Justice must never lose, no matter what the means! Blue! Yellow! Your deaths have awakened a burning passion in my heart! Uh, I avoided hitting any vital spots, so they should still be alive! Evil fiends! Are you ready? Face the power of justice! Okay, so I'm pretty sure the Prism Rangers show up in every game, but this is the only one that has them as like the, uh, as like a main, like they show up in the story. Um, okay, so this should be good. Let's do that. Aw, oh, damn, they are so close to being dead. Um, that's fine, I'll just leave it there. Then I'll come down. Aw, oh, damn, took my kills. Aw, oh, shit, is this thing? Just annihilate them. Just flaunt. Oh, wow. My people aren't 
strong enough to one hit anymore. Oh no! Still haven't killed anyone. Oop, no, do not want to go back to the cable board. Deals. Uh, heart of evil. What's up? Prince, is this the heart of evil? Seems That's so. right. That's what the map says. No one's here. Which means. Now hold it right there. Hey, it's Mid Boss again. What do you want? I'm busy right now. Tisk, tisk, tisk. You weren't thinking of calling yourself the Overlord without first settling things with moi, were you? I already settled things with you. Twice, as a matter of fact. Silly you. Did you think that I was serious? Weren't you? Not at all. That was merely camouflage, so that you would let your guard down. Now, you shall witness my true power! I have attained ultra speed by training and training and training, all while wearing 100 ton boxers! Can your eyes keep up with moi? Here I come! The throne is mine! Okay, and I'm pretty sure the uh, game over, like the restart, happens any time you lose to mid boss. So you have to be careful not to. Probably buy her a new gun because uh, she doesn't seem to be doing enough damage. I'm gonna keep flying out. So I possibly just take some attacks and. Uh, I really hope this isn't like a person to sleep. Characters. These guys are getting in my way.
kill him. I'm surprised. Uh, I'm just getting disappointed all over today. Yes. Uh. Spread that very small amount of XP. Right. Really? Really? <sighs> you fucks. I don't want to attack you. I'm just gonna send these guys back in. This is what I had originally intended Flan to be used for, like when I was talking about her in the end of OP, where she's just gonna be the healer. Uh, Hurricane Slash. that, then I probably would have, uh, I would have used a great heart on him, just to make sure I could kill him in that next move. Good. Oh! 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 Uh, sudden stomach cramps! Just when I was getting started, I, I beg your pardon, but... Need to use the restroom. Consider yourselves lucky you've been spared. Au revoir! He ran away. His excuses are getting more and more pathetic. Huh? So, is that it? That means. I'm the Overlord! 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 Hmm. The prince is now the overlord. It's so hard to believe. <laughs> now, now, look at him. He is so happy. He pretends to be evil, but he can be cute sometimes. You think? Well, he's just a kid, that's all. Anyway, shouldn't you be worried? Huh? What do you mean? You helped the prince become the overlord. Uh... Master Lamington! Master Lamington! Are you here? You make a ruckus every time you are here to see me, Volcanus. What is it this time? How can I not make a commotion? Lahar, the son of King Krachevskoy, has been crowned the new overlord! Hmm... That's not all. That trainee Flan helped him win the throne! Is that so? Oh, this is no longer a case of disobeying orders. This is treason! You are correct. So, what are you planning to do? Hmm. I will need to think about it. Think about it? Think about it, you say? This is a grave matter! We can't just ignore it! I will handle this problem! You have no objections, do you? <sighs> Oh, dear. Oh, what should I do? If the Seraph hears of this, there is no telling what punishment awaits me. I might be dismissed from my angel trainee position. Who cares? Why don't you change jobs now and become a demon? No! Oh, Master Lamington, please guide me. Overlord! 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 <laughs> I 
like how, I like the idea that he's just continuously chanting them while they're having that conversation. The evil Empress Etna has sent monsters to take over the world! But when evil creeps up on people, Flan, the messenger of love, comes to the rescue! As long as evil exists, Flan's battle will never end! Run, Flan! Don't lose heart, Flan! Let the people's cheers bring you courage! Transform! Guardian Flan! Next on Guardian Flan, Warrior of Love, Episode 7, Drop Dead Etna. Always keep love in your heart. <laughs> I always wanted to try this. Flan, what you doing? Oh, hi, Ep! Okay. Uh... Because this is the last episode I'm recording today, I'm just going to start this chapter. <laughs> Jeez, you just keep laughing and laughing. How can I not? I'm now the Overlord. That means that I'm the most eminent demon in all of the Netherworld. I am aware of that, but ever since you've become the Overlord, you have done nothing but laugh. You don't understand a thing. Laughing is a very important aspect of being the Overlord. Besides, there isn't any urgent matter that's suitable for my first act as King Laharl the Terrible. Oh, Prince! I got a job for ya! Call me your highness. I'm the Overlord now. Ah, come on. That's a minor detail. Minor detail? So, what kind of job is it? You want me to make it rain pepper on Earth so they can't stop sneezing? Or do you want me to give human kids an addictive video game that will deprive them of their sleep? This? Uh, no. Come in, Aramis. Yeah, what's up, kid? Who's this kid? Don't call me a kid. You're more of a kid yourself. What? Who the hell do you think I am? Now, now. He is just a child. Shut up, Black Chest. What did you say, you? <gasps> I mustn't. In times like this, love is the answer. With love, there is understanding. Hey, does she have a few screws loose or something? Huh, you got some attitude, kid. Just like you, Prince. Yeah, right. So, what's he got to do with the job? Oh, yeah, his pets are missing. Hmm? Huh? And? And your job's to look for them. Why would I, the Overlord, look for some stupid little brat's pets? Ridiculous! Absolutely ridiculous! Bring me something more fitting for my first task as Overlord! I refuse. It may seem ridiculous to you, but it's important to him. This is a perfect way to begin your rule as Overlord. And if you don't do it, I'm never going to accept you as the Overlord. What, what are you getting so mad for? It's not like you. Answer me. Will you do it or not? Ugh. Fine, I'll do it, I'll do it. Good, and you better not slack off. Ugh. Why am I, the Overlord of the Netherworld, taking orders from this annoying brat? Episode 7 of Being an Overlord. Okay. And we are... I wonder if our class changed. No, it's still Demon Prince. Nope. That, that sucks. Oh well, doesn't really matter. So with that, I'm going to end the episode here uh, because uh, we've been running a little long. Uh, let's just check out the... Uh, what's kind of Salamander's Breath. A flood of zombies. Zombies could be the Angermist pet, but eating the zombies. Okay. So Salamander's Breath, Scorching Wind. Okay. So now we know where we're going and whatnot. So I hope you all have a very nice day, and I'll see you in the next episode. Thank you.